guys got a, a plan or you, yeah, we got a couple of weed? Yeah. <laughs> okay. That's awesome. Person. A couple of weed <laughs> and a dream featuring N.A. Poe and Steve Miller Miller. Well, the Panic Hour in Philly Normal had another successful smoke out. There's probably 150 to 200 people here again, which means our numbers are remaining consistent. And then where's our next one? Our next one will be in March. On the four. No, it's March now. You know what I am? <laughs> I am high upon the marijuana. And you know what? I'm not ashamed to admit it because I don't know shame. Yeah, so it's April 20th here at the Liberty Bell once again. 420 is internationally known as a time to celebrate marijuana. It's time to get behind, out Do behind the computers and come on out. It's Hitler's smoking. birthday. Columbine happened that day. <laughs> Edit this. Um, Attack. <laughs> Yo, if you look like Cho Seung Wee and you want to come out to the smoke town and you want to get high on marijuana and then you want to you want to save a horse and ride a bolo, Steve Miller Miller's encouraging that. I can prevent the next school shooting. Send me your angry Korean. So April 20th here at the Liberty Bell, the birth of freedom. Smoke down 4, 420. Come and hang out with us. It's going to be in the afternoon that day. Why is it important to smoke weed for civil disobedience? Because you are owning yourself. You're saying that no one can do anything for you, Steve. They can tell you what to do. Can tell you do what to do? No, you try. You try mightily. And Babylon tries mightily. But you can't boss Steve Miller Miller around. You can't boss N.A. Poe around. And Babylon's insane, lunatic, false teaching laws aren't going to boss anyone here around. I don't want to have a huge that if I didn't do anything wrong and I didn't even get a say in it. Good damn question. <laughs> um, Fuck! Fuck, fuck, fuck.